The Verde River, the most extensive surviving river in the state, is a green artery pulsing through the heart of Arizona. It's one of the most ecologically significant areas in the entire Southwest. It's always been a hard-working river as, as long as there have been people, and uh, we've always utilized it. But now our actions threaten the very existence of the river. There's absolutely no secret that the explanation for that is primarily a groundwater pumping results in a, a decrease and an eventual elimination of those springs that feed the upper 25 miles of the Verde River. And I've heard a lot of old people, they say, hey, Juhuhi, do that we ought to, and they're not even wise. Don't they understand? Water is precious. They just play with it. Stop and think that three and a half million people depend on water from the Verde River alone. Therein is enough reason to protect the river. It's going to take a lot of public awareness, and that's all of us. And this water then benefits all of these plants and animals. This is a major source of drinking water for the Verde Valley, for Phoenix. And then it's just one of the most beautiful places to be, to camp, to hike, recreate. When people ask about what is a sustainable water future, what we mean by that is we want our water supply, one, to be to last indefinitely. There has to be a balance in our aquifers such that our water supply is not depleted and that it's maintained indefinitely. And the same thing when it comes to rivers. We want rivers that are continuously flowing and be able to support a, um, a wildlife and uh, a bird community. And we don't want to see those rivers dry up. When we were created, we had to be good stewards of the, of the land. So that includes plants, animals, water. And the Verde is a great example of a place where individual citizens, not necessarily with a lot of prior training, have just realized in their hearts and in their heads that this place matters and have jumped in and have played a big, big role. And the more people that can jump in and help out, uh, the better. It, it's, it's not an easy thing to save a desert river. We have a great opportunity and we need everyone's voice in, in the fight to save the Verde. My question is, when are you going to learn the real meaning of stewardship. So far, the Verde survives. A lush, living, riparian oasis in the desert, a green jewel in the desert southwest, and it's important that you know about it. It is good.